how to transfer outlook email to the new computer if you want to transfer uh, your all email or data from old computer uh, outlook uh, from old outlook to the new computer new computer outlook so in this video today i'm going to talk about so let's start with the video guys before we start i request you if you like this video hit the like button subscribe my channel and don't forget comments below okay so just uh, i just opened my outlook so there is a way you can take the one uh, you know backup file which is it's called psd file and you get uh, imported the new outlook so i can do this go to the file and under the file you have to click on open and export here you can see the export import export option just tap on it now this mini window will be open now we need to export data so just click on export file and here you have to choose the outlook file okay <laughs> if you are exporting your outlook contacts you have to uh, uh, click on this okay i will show you next uh, next step but first i'm going to show you how you can um you know transfer your all emails from outlook so just select the outlook psd file so now here you can see i am using the more than one email id i am using the four email id sorry three email id this this and this one so you have to select the email id email account first email account or if you are using only one account then just select the email id or account and just uh, ensure that this option should be check mark because it will be include all subfolder so just check mark on it you can use filter you can use filter if you want now click on next now here you can see this is psd file will be create okay so uh here so here you can uh, they will show outlook show you the existing psd file where you have already you know back up the maybe you have back up the data so you can change the psd file or psd file location just go to the browse and here you can change the location but i say you don't change the location because it's by default outlook psd file you can change the name you can change them from here so you can change like backup today you can give the today date or anything you want you can rename and just click so you can see the outlook data file name has been changed now here you can see the option there you can uh, choose the three option out, out of three option first uh, you can replace the duplicate with the item export it or allow the duplicates items to be create and do not export duplicate item so i just suggest you to do not export duplicate item or you can allow this because sometime you need it so i just don't want to duplicate item just finish then you can uh, set the password for your phd file or backup file so if you forget this file uh, password uh, of this your file then it will be very hard to recover there is a software paid software you have to uh, you know use for this uh, password recover but as i should don't use the password just click on next so this file will be uh, you know uh, created in your uh, selected location and it will be open here okay you can see this file will be open here automatically so if you don't see file here you can go in file go to the open export go to the open data file so here you can see we have created this file just select the file or you can open it so this is for your uh, existing uh, this file has been open so now so if you want to move this all data to the new computer and go to the file again go to the open uh, open and export tab go to the open file and here you have to copy this file just copy the file and uh, paste to the uh, uh, copy this file and paste to the new computer okay so i just create the folder here like new computer okay and i paste this file here so this file i got okay so already uh, okay so my outlook is open that's why it is not paste so you have to just copy it and close the outlook first you have to close the outlook then go to the folder okay i just uh, close my outlook now here i can copy this file now i'm going to open my outlook again so just assume this is my new computer outlook so now this is uh, so uh, assume that this is my new computer outlook just configure your email id and now you want to uh, use your backup then just go to the file and you can import the data file or you can just open the data file just open go to the open data file find the folder just click on this file and just open it so it will open in others this you can see 
the others outlook data file outlook data file will be open here yeah and you can use it and if you want to export it in your inbox only then import it in your inbox only so you can import from here uh, go to the account setting sorry go to the open and export go to the import export now we need to import it so just click on import from another program select PST file now browse this file we have which save the okay I have saved here I just browse it I just do not duplicate and just next it is already you know available in my you know data file so it is not it will be not import but you can just select the file and just click on next it will be import okay so I hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching